A question about that, because when you're like pushing the pose, how do you balance keeping something centered versus like pushing the pose so that it's more like yeah, yeah. Off, yeah. off balance almost? If I wanted to rotate her chest back here, yeah, she's kind of off balance, right? Mm -hmm. So what would I do? I would push her pelvis forward out here, right? And then mm -hmm. she's back here again. That's all. And like right. this, what if we just push that arm across, right? Like all these, like all these shapes you can like push these concepts, right? Okay. And then you got like this nice shape we talked about, pelvis is rotated over, chest is back here. And then this foot could be more like here now, right? And now I'm like pushing that shape there. Mm. So see, see the difference? Yeah. So. I always I always draw over my reference for my key poses. Yeah. Would you recommend trying to draw do draw overs but like pushing it? Yeah. Take the same pose and just be like, well, what if I just pushed her forward or backwards? Start there. What if I okay. pushed her forward and backwards? And then and then just make judgments like, well, do I like this pose better or like this pushed version? And then and then ask yourself like what what is the flow doing here, right? So maybe mm -hmm. I want to push the arm across the body here and let this one kind of come out here and like leave with the elbow more right you know disney always talking about flower sack animation right mm -hmm. the whole like straights against curves thing that the whole point here is like tension versus like slack right so like same thing here too what if i just push all this tension here and then get the crack of the body here right yeah so now yeah so then i'm just like thinking about okay how does that all resolve through here and 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 then how I'm gonna keep her still in balance here, you know. That's what I would say. Yeah, do what you're doing, but then don't just trace the pose. Yeah. Embellish the pose in your drawing, and you'll start to understand like where the core movement's at versus where the counter is at, and like how you can lead into the next pose. Because then it might go into the reverse of this would be then coming back down here and like pushing the weight back here, maybe. For example, right. Like maybe coming through here or something. I don't know. Whatever. You know, how could I go from here to there? You know. That's super. This was super cool. That was a super cool lesson. <laughs>